In Chapter 3 of FE9, Grail hears of Ike's insubordination in the previous chapter and grounds him for 10 days, but defers his punishment because there is work to do. This time, a pirate ship has docked at a port and is harassing the locals the Grail mercenaries have been hired to kill them all. Most of the roster has been temporarily rotated out, and for this chapter, we have Ike and Titania alongside Shinon, a sniper, and Gatry, an armor knight. The enemies on this map are easy enough to handle, but as I approach the ship, Marcia, an NPC Pegasus knight, flies into the upper left and has a conflict with the pirates, so I have to hurry to get to her before she is killed. If you're unlucky, then she can die immediately, which is almost what happens, but Marcia gets lucky and dodges a 66% hit, allowing her to heal and survive. I manage to get Ike over to Marcia to talk to her, allowing her to leave the map, after which the only remaining enemies on the map are three pirates armed with hand axes. One typical characteristic of hand axes is that they have a low hit rate and don't lose durability when missing attacks, which means that in a game that does not have diminishing XP gain, they are potentially a source of infinite XP. Of my units, Titania has the best avoid, and is probably the only unit suitable for this method. I checked their hit rate against Titania and is quite low at only 14%, and in a 2 RN system, the true hit rate is even lower at around 4%. This is quite low, but for gaining XP from dodge grinding, the ideal enemy hit rate is 0%. I scour the map for any means of increasing my avoid and I find one. There's a single thicket in the lower right of the map which grants plus 10 avoid. This meta shattering discovery gives me a clear opportunity to go infinite on this map. I kite one bandit over to the thicket, leaving everyone else out of range while Titania hides in the brush to gain 10 more avoid, bringing the bandit's accuracy closer to zero. I have Titania repeatedly dodge the bandit's hand axe over and over for a single X for combat, allowing her to gain theoretically infinite XP. As I continue the dodge grind for several hundred turns, the bandit's hit rate actually fluctuates slightly, and this is because of a strange mechanic in Path of Radiance called Battle Rhythm, where every unit's hit and avoid can vary slightly between plus 10 and minus 10 of their baseline. As Titania levels up, she gains enough stats to consistently dodge hand axes, even when her and the bandit's battle rhythms are unfavorable. Several levels in, I feel comfortable enough with Titania's avoid to speed up the process by luring in the two other hand axe bands to throw hand axes at her while she hides in the thicket, allowing me to do the grind at roughly 3 times the speed. I continue this process until I reach turn 959 when Titania reaches her level cap at level 20, but even with all of this effort, her strength is still well below average. 